Hi, this is Dan Seifer with MobileBurn.com, and here we are at Mobile World Congress 2012 in Barcelona, Spain, checking out the ASUS Transformer Pad 700 Infinity Series. Now, the ASUS Transformer Pad 700 is an upgrade over the original Transformer Prime in that it has a higher resolution screen. The screen is 1920 by 1200 pixels of resolution. ASUS says it's the first full HD tablet on the market, and it really looks great. It's an IPS Plus display, so it has a tremendous viewing angles and great colors and just pops, uh, images just pop right off the screen. Now as far as the tablet itself, it's powered by op a couple different options. If you happen to get the LTE version when that comes out, you're likely to see the Qualcomm S4 dual core processor, which is uh, clocked at 1.5 gigahertz. And if you happen to opt for another option, you can get the NVIDIA uh, Tegra 3 quad core processor clocked at 1.6 gigahertz. Looking at the hardware itself, We've got a very thin device, it's only 8.5 millimeters thick, so it's very thin in the hand, just like the original Transformer Prime. The rear has a spun metal uh, finish to it, and there's an 8 megapixel camera with LED flash and f2.2 aperture lens. This is running Android 4.0 Ice Cream Sandwich, uh, just like any other Transformer Prime. But the other thing that is also, uh, because it's a Transformer Prime, it comes with this, or has an optional keyboard dock here that you can dock the uh, 700 series into. Once you've done that, you now have full access to a full keyboard as well as a uh, mouse pointer and touchpad, so you essentially have a full laptop on the go. If you close this here, we can take a look at how thick it is when closed. It's really quite thin. It's thinner than most any netbook we've seen and almost as thin as a MacBook Air. The uh, keyboard dock does offer options such as a full-size SD card slot and a uh, more USB ports, full-size USB ports, and it includes an internal battery so it recharges the Transformer 700 while it's plugged in. ASUS plans to bring this to market in the coming months. It'll come in various versions, such as uh, I've mentioned earlier, LTE and HSPA+, as well as Wi-Fi only models. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to see this in the States someday. So there you go, that's our quick look at the ASUS, uh, ASUS Transformer Pad Infinity 700. This is Dan Seifert with MobileBurn.com. Thanks for watching.